We saw a video called Hello Kitty Cafe and the story about Simon and Martina who went to the cafe and they were bored. Especially Simon, this video was boring to me too. Now I will introduce about boring and high expectations. First, boring. Example 1. A movie trailer was so exciting, so you went to see the movie, but it's boring. Example 2. Users were good concert and all the people that the good comment on the website so you went so there. But the concert just has one symphony they prepared so you have to listen to it five times until the concert finishes. That's a good concert, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. yeah. Good, let's go. Oh. Oh. In my experience, I heard a super boring opera. Me and my family love to go to operas, so we bought a ticket for an opera that was designed beautifully. Our family arrived at the place where the opera was going to start. We sat down and waited for the opera to start. The opera started unexpectedly. The opera was so bored. I couldn't wait until the end, so I also did game while opera. That was the best boring opera ever. You are excited about something, 100% excited, but when the thing that you were excited about was bad than what you were thinking, you feel futility. These are the examples. The test is moved to next week. Ah! Example 2. You went to see a movie you wanted to see. Then you went to the theater, but then it closed. Go to the theater. The theater is closed. What? What? What's happening here? In my experience, I had a test and I got 100% on the test. So my mom packed her stuffs into her traveling package. 
She promised to go to Oak Valley when I get 100% on my test. So I wanted to sleep there for five days. My mother asked, can we have a five-day room? Then they applied no. Then I got shocked. There were no room left. So I feel felt fertility. Because of this event, I never had high expectations. You are 100. Yay! Mom, I want to go to Ski uh, Oak Valley for five days. Okay, I'll find for the room. Oh, there's no room for five days. What? Oh my god. Yeah. Dun, dun, dun.